Oh god. I have to come on the mic now. Sim, you just made me laugh big time there, my friend. I was just there uh, casually slurping my nice hot cup of coffee, look across and was like, oh shoot, the mic's hot. Okay, I'll just mute that and carry on slurping my coffee. <laughs> what is going on, everyone? Hopefully you guys are doing good. Yeah, I am slightly late. The time difference is killing me. You guys have changed your times in the UK, so now we are four hour time difference from Eastern Standard to UK. So instead of me starting the stream at two o'clock, I'm now starting at three o'clock when I usually end. So yeah, uh, that's throwing me all out of whack today because for whatever reason, I thought I was starting at one and I was all mentally planned for one o'clock start. Yeah, nope. So, hopefully you guys are doing good. Turn down the audio a bit. Pull up the game and hopefully it's gonna work. Uh, shoot, uh, you said shoot, I thought you swore. <laughs> nope. Done it before though, we'll do it again, no doubt. There we go, happy days. Landy, fun playing with you on Forza. Glad you enjoyed it. Bill's team, Max, you made it to a stream, geez. Oh my god, look at you, Bill. Look at you go. I need to organize someone to get down there, bud. How are you doing, anyway? No, he's completely derailed my stream. So, we've got a couple of new pieces of machinery. This is from Creative Mesh, the guys who did the straw add-on. I've given it a go. I really don't care for it. It's a pain in the ass. It really is, but it is nice. A contradiction on that, I know. And then we've got Peter J's Massey forklift that he put out in a little pack that went up on FSUK yesterday. So we'll be giving that a go. And I'm hoping to get time to, well, fast forward and harvest today. That's the main. Uh, did you like my horn? Uh, I can't remember. Hey, we're good. You are doing good, bud. Well, I can't remember what your username was in that, to tell you the truth. Hey, Hogman, what's up, bud? Oh, you're about to freak when you see who else is in here. So, uh, I think we'll start this up and take it back. So we'll just leave this here for now. Oh, by the way, Bill, how did you enjoy all that snow that you guys got the other day? We got none of it. Yeah, it is, Rob. This is Shamrock. This is just stock. Oh, that's the same horn that I had for the longest time. Hey, Jay, what's up? Fun of vlogs, what's going on? Winter sucks. <laughs> it's only just started, my man. I only just started. You've got the equipment, though. I don't. I've got a snow shovel. Hey, and I, what's up? Reading chat and not concentrating. If you're on about this, this is up on Tech Modern's Facebook page. Not Tech Modern? No, not Tech Modern. What am I on about? Wow. Um, Creative Mesh, the same guys who did the Stratum. Did this. Oh, actually, I need to switch on this to get rid of it okay apparently I can't sell it here I thought I could <laughs> Liam welcome to the Lanarkie family heaven juice day Yeah, uh, Maddie, I'm doing good one by yourself. And I, what's up? Alright, unfortunately, this still isn't ready. I thought it would be, but it's not quite. It may have to go until the next day, is what I'm thinking. It's literally on the very last bit before they sort of flip over there. Uh, we have John Deere 7730 with a snow plow. Oh, snow blower, sorry. Uh, makes it easy. 
Oh, nice. Yeah, it would be nice. We got a fairly big driveway here. So it is a pain in the ass. It's a good workout, but a pain in the ass to do with a snow shovel, let me tell you. Not about getting a uh, snow blow for this year, which would be nice. I'm good, been playing Red Dead Redemption, you son of a. <laughs> That's all I'll say to that, that game looks sick. I've not seen any gameplay of it just because I don't want to watch it and be even more jelly than I already slightly am. Place a few pumpkins around the map. I guess you'll need to stay tuned for tomorrow's video, won't you? Miss Patern, as usual. Nailed your ads with Red Dead. Do you mean Red Dead nailed ads everywhere? They were literally advertising everywhere. YouTube, every website you can think of down here had it on there. TV, you couldn't get away from it, it's crazy. They piled a lot of money into advertisements. Can you blame them though? And how? And I've got to give Chris the Irish Gamer credit here for what he happened to say in TeamSpeak a few moment, moments ago, and I think he's right. Farming Simulator usually releases this time of year, right? October. Well, if they knew when Red Dead was getting released, Maybe that is why they chose a different release date than normal. Because let's face it, Red Dead would have completely buried Farming Simulator in sales if they released the same sort of time. It would have absolutely nuked it. Uh, send you an audio clip, it's stream safe. Where? Facebook? Simulator Game, what's up? Even hello. Let's mute the music, just because of Sim. And again. Could see you simulate. Hey, animals up. Did you see the FS19 Red Dead ad? Yes, is that what you're on about? I did see that just before heading off a shower. You should loan Bill's T-Max, John Deere, American Farmer, Deluxe. I think he would love that game. I don't have Deluxe, just have normal. If he didn't need the disc to run it, I would most definitely let him uh, throw it on the computer so he could have a go on it. He'd probably like it for sure. Stream alert audio right there. Possibly. Possibly. I'll give it one more try. I think we may have to feed the animals one more time and then uh, cycle through the night. And no, no, no. And no harvesting for you. Alright, so let's see if we can get away with just fast timing without the animals croaking. They've got some food at least, so they should be okay. Well, Ethan, mine's genuine. And there's the pumpkins, by, by the way. So I have got a couple. Having gone full out Halloween themed, because I will be streaming, in theory, on Wednesday. Maybe the last stream of the week as well, guys, on Wednesday. There's some stuff going on at the back end of the week, so. Alrighty, we'll blip through time. Can't wait until Fortnite dies. You and everyone else that doesn't play it. It will, though. 
Guarantee you. It'll take a little while, but it will. Yeah, we're going to have to go for the day. That sucks. What do I think of Peter J's pack? Very nice. Hey, so what's up? How's it going? Autumn is here. So now, in theory, I can harvest. Looky there. Uh, do we need to feed the cows, though? Are they desperate? Yeah, they kind of are. All right, we'll go feed them first. Twitch just offered you affiliate new no things. Yep. It doesn't take long to get Twitch affiliate, it really doesn't. I'm surprised you got it actually that quick, Sim, with how little you stream. What do you think of Vox's new map for 19? Honestly, I'm not going to form an opinion on it until I see it in 19. It may look okay in, in 17, but who knows what it will look like in 19. Personally, I would have kept that under the radar and not released any photos until it's in 19. Hey, Cuba, what's up, bud? Spider on the wall. Probably. I need to be much bigger on Twitch before I took that. Affiliate's not worth it, Virtual. Full partnership is worth it, but affiliate is not. And you'd need to stop YouTube. You can't stream on both if you're doing that. That's what screwed Dave over. Yeah, I saw the Red Dead video Giants put up. Uh, no, it is not. It is on Creative Mesh's Facebook page. If you really want to download it. It's the same people who did the straddle. It's probably been passed around quite a few websites at this point, though. I didn't really get that video. Just doesn't make sense. Basically, it's them acknowledging Red Dead. Because let's face it, they're game developers. They probably are gamers just like all of us and enjoy the game and have been playing the game. Acknowledging that because it's, well, it's huge, let's face it. I'd love to see the stats for Red Dead sales. It's probably through the damn roof. And doing a bit of cheeky advertisement going, hey. On the 20th, our game comes out. Bill, Bill, what's up, buddy? How you been keeping? Nice forklift. Which one? This or the... Massey at the top, though. Red Dead Redemption video. It was just a bit of fun. Exactly, they're gamers. Hell, I think when I was in Discord earlier, I saw one of them playing it. This is uh, out of the classic pack, Bill, by Maddox Jess. He won it as part of the competition that Giants did a little while back now. Are you going to see Johnny English? I wouldn't mind going to see that, medley. But I don't know if it's humour Jess would get. But who knows. Well, you don't need any sources for that one. Most stuff lifts bales with ease in this, though. I think from what uh, Bill, uh, or Bullet Bill, should I say, there's two Bills in here right now, and Oxygen David have said in the past, I think it was Bill, that one of the things that I've got in kind of messes with the physics of bales, so it probably lightens them. 
way more, more than they should be. The Massey Ferguson telehandler in 19. There's no Massey forklift. The forklift is a Manitou in 19. Which, yeah, I've kind of freaked out about that when I saw that, and I will be using it a lot. Yeah, I bet this will be I'll be over here for quite a while. Not anytime soon, anyway. Has that been confirmed? That is literally by Giants, that's all the DL, all the JCB in the game. Because you got to take what they show on the website with a huge pinch of salt. Uh, someone emailed them the other day, Adam, and they got back to them saying we haven't got anything to share at this time so take that for what you will to me that kind of sounds like they will but at the same time if you ask me the release of that was a complete and utter mess very broken on release even though they got told about some of the major game breaking issues by myself by sim and that was to our contact at aerosoft so they should have known about the issues, yet they still went ahead and released it with those issues. And then took how many months to fix it? Uh, the tractor in the thumbnail is this beast. Peter J, FSUK. Can't wait to give it a proper go. It's pretty cool, this thing. Hey, Ryan, what's up? I just kind of need to go for a muck out of the mount too. Savine? Savine? Did I get it right? Yeah, hey, Robbie, what's up? Alright, so we'll throw two loads of feed in with these guys and then we'll go harvest, which I'm most certainly looking forward to. Uh, there's only one wheel loader so far. I've got my doubts if we'll see the leaper returning as far as the, t the wheel loader goes. I'm not sure how that stands with class and leaper. I don't know if class have exclusivity to the agricultural sector with the leap air now, so we may not see a leap air again. Can you show me the skid steers and vehicles you have? I don't have any skid steers. Good of you, I got that forklift, uh, but moving the forks on it. It's all like the Clark. The Clark forklift is sick, it really is good. The only reason I put the stride on, on here, I wasn't going to, but I did it the other night. It's just like, it's the final hurrah for the map. Let's face it, how much realistically more am I going to be on FS17? Probably not too, too much more. The other uh, 
telehandler that I had in the thumbnail I've already got rid of. Stay tuned for tomorrow's video for that, if you guys want to see that. So just smash that subscribe button. Shameless bit of advertisement there. If you want to see the video tomorrow. Daniel, hi Landy, totally, totally not lurking in the shadows again. Not good, my friend, not good. Another month until Christmas, yeah, don't remind me. Catch you later, Virtual. I'll play for 17 as there's nothing to do until 19 comes out. Good God. I need a break from the game. I'll be completely honest with you. There's no way I could play that much. Maybe a case wheel loader? Possibly. When is 19 now? 19 is out the 20th of November. Plus, I would need to give myself a little break before I get access to it and I start going crazy with content. Or recording content, at least. EJ, what's up, bud? Okay. Those are fed. The manure can wait. I want to go harvest, so without further ado. Shut that down now. Let's get going. Not started FS to play in about five months. Probably after the DLC right map. Started playing Minecraft. <laughs> oh, don't I have the canola straw in? Okay, I'm actually gonna pause the game. Or save, quit out, and see if I've got that mod installed. Is there such thing as a case wheel loader? Uh, more than likely, yeah. Case are in construction, so the construction side of things. So while I'm doing this, I'll throw up that. Just like simulate. I've not broken something, but I forgot to put something in, possibly. So it'll be a perfect time to advertise my instant gaming link if you guys want any games on the cheap click that link yes there is yep i've installed 17 from the pc i'm going to take a break until 19. yeah i think a lot of us are going to be hitting that point very soon as far as me when that happens content wise on the channel is going to be probably very varied i want to put a lot of different stuff up there just stuff that i've been playing There's a case wheel loader out there as a mod. Yeah, I used that on Lone Oak. Canola straw. I did not have it enabled. Did that instant gaming link go through? Yeah, it did. Put it over on Twitch if I've got anyone over on Twitch. Do I actually have anyone over on Twitch right now? I think Simulate is doing a Halloween special live stream. He's already done that. He already finished. As far as I know, he was in my stream. I was, wasn't expecting him to be done so quick. Uh, Lanky Kid, do you play Train Sim World? Yes, I play Train Sim World, but I get bored of it very, very quickly. I start a thing on it and just get bored. To tell you the truth, I don't have much interest in it until they've added Steam Trains in it. It's a great game, but lord, it's boring. I thought about loading it up recently. It's kind of weird how you guys noticed quite a lot of that DLC disappeared off of the Steam... Well, it helps if I turn the machine on, right? Ah, oh, you can't do it for soybeans? Really? 
That sucks. I thought you could. Well, we've got one field as Kanoda that we'll be able to use. Like Spike 105 in here. Let's see if we can get a 50 likes in, guys. I don't want to be burned out farm sim before 19 was released. I think... Wow, I'm missing a lot. I think 19 is going to bring a lot of different stuff to the game. Like, it's going to look 10 times better. Physics. I don't think anyone can speak of the physics yet. I'd love to know a bit more about them personally. But it's got a lot to offer. You will never get this. La 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 la. <laughs> Pretty much so. Pretty much. You and TeamSpeak, by the way. I know Chris has got a couple of questions for you about how you did some stuff. Oh, just for Sim as he sent me that voice clip. I'm right back at you, my friend. Right back at you. Since 13. <laughs> a lot of you guys have been around on my channel since me and Bill did that FS13 little sketch thing. When I was sat in his basement <laughs> playing on his son's computer, getting him all set up. That's kind of comical. That was with NI Modern's Fergie Grey Pack. And that video did very well on both of our channels. And that so many people want us to play Farm Sim again together like that. I feel that's what made it special, is because it was literally a one-time thing. We, we did play again in 15, I think it was, on a server. But it just wasn't the same, it was lagging like crazy. Surprised me that all the featurettes... Uh, such so done on the Europe map. Not all of them are on the Europe map. Some of them are on the American map, I think. Yeah, the Mahindra feature. That was the European map. Not the European map, the American map, sorry. You see the American flag in it. The one that's got the whale skeleton in it. Video Master 2000, what's going on? Blue Gummy Bear Vlogs, what's up? Apparently he likes only the Blue Gummy Bears. That's favoritism, just saying. Well, I was planning on doing the other f soybean field today, but I'll probably end up cranking out the other canola field. So I really wanted to harvest, uh, put some of the, some straw down. And do some of the pellets today. Not unless I go around and find a wheat field that c I can buy. Oh, I bet they're all harvested already, haven't they? Oh, that's going to be the kicker. Yes. Son of a gun. Well, apparently I am poop out of luck with that. Hey, Barry, I'm doing good with myself and Adam. Hello. Has anyone played Ride OP since the last update? Uh, what do you mean Ride OP? Well, 98 watching... 98? And it was higher than that a minute ago. Good old fluctuations. Gotta admit, our yield is really poor out of this field so far, it seems. Because some people are saying, oh, yeah, William. People always say that. Whenever a new game comes out, they instantly go, oh, it's just the same game with new graphics. 
every time and it's the same people that say that a few more videos come out a few more pictures come out and you'll see them write another post with a tail between their legs going actually looks kind of nice and then the game comes out and inevitably you see them posting all the same pictures and videos that they used to in the t past going oh it's a great game there's a model that i can think of which i always bring this up which will do exactly that and i think has minus the video part Hey, CD, what's up? I'm doing good, Michael. I'm glad you enjoyed the video. That really does suck. I can't do straw. I really thought I'd be able to put, the, put this into straw with that canola thing. Evidently, I was wrong. Right, operator sim. Never heard of it. Not even joking, never heard of it. Pre orders Farming Simulator 19. I already can't wait for it. Nice, where do you get it from? Consoles might get Shamrock soon. Jordan, honestly, don't hold your breath, my friend. As Giant said upon their testing section on the forum, mods releases will be very sporadic. So take that with a grain of salt. Actually, a handful of salt. And I wouldn't expect it anytime soon, if at all, now. Yeah, it's all that fast farming. I don't see the point. Uh, I don't know why they don't release a version A specifically made construction simulator for PC. I know they bought out that construction simulator too, but that is a very, very bad looking mobile port from what I've seen. Get on with your ready stream. Well, if you guys didn't keep on popping up over my phone when I'm trying to do stuff on that as well, I wouldn't need to keep on making it go away. No offense, but what on earth is the point in releasing a map for a whole 20 days? Yep. I mean, at that point, it's purely down to Giants, isn't it, Matt? What If they can get time to do it, which I imagine probably like the day before FS drops will get an absolute slob of mods up on the mod hub. Like they've gone through and tested. I can imagine that's what we'll get. Because you know damn well there's going to be people that still play the game. And there's going to be people that probably get the game for Christmas, so they have to wait. Oh, nice one, dude. Yeah, Shadow, what's up? I know Simulator has done a video on Ride Operator. Yeah, if I remember correctly, that game wasn't exactly cheap. If memory serves correctly. Could be wrong. Probably am. I'm gonna get back up here and give myself actually proper room. Uh, but Red Dead Redemption 2 Friday, it's a brilliant game, no doubt. From what you guys have seen so far, is the storyline as long as the original was? Because that's what made the game was single player. Single player aspect back then was just sick. It really was. My biggest fear, with especially the way Rockstar have gone in recent years, aka GTA, they've ruined it and just put a very, fairly short storyline in and it's all got multiplayer. Pants Hoffs. Why, hello. I've went to Christmas Play 19. Yeah, I figured there'll be people. It was cheap, but yeah. Oh, yes, that's right. You do, don't you? 
I'm thinking of uh, uh, the theme park tycoon one, whatever they call that. I got a game on Steam for you. It's just the discs. Steam okay. I had 17 on disc. Honestly, David, depending on if you want to play it as soon as the game comes out, get it on Giant Software site, which is a dig digital download through them. If you're not too worried about the release time, uh, or you work and you get back around 3, 4 o'clock in the afternoon, in time for 5 o'clock, get it on Steam. I don't think... Yeah, Planet Coaster is what I'm thinking of. I don't think Steam are going to release at 12 o'clock. We could be shocked, but previously with the other farms and games, it has been 5 o'clock the next day. So it is not midnight launch, usually on Steam. Emphasis on usually. I've played all Friday or Saturday and I'm only 50% through. Wow. Apparently it's got 60 hours of storyline. Dang, that's cool. Okay, this song's horrible. Uh, 17 dropped the same day. Decisions, decisions, really. Dang. Battlefield games, I don't know, ever since Battlefield 1, which I have got, I barely played, and I really should play more of it. Oh, I uh, oh, no. Just I really haven't played it all. Like, for me, Battlefield is all about, sort of, modern combat. I don't like when they do whacked out stuff. Be cool if they go back to Second World War, not as early as they did with the First World War. That was a bit much. But there again, didn't last uh, in 17, Farm Sim and Call of Duty come out at the same time? And Farm Sim actually outsold Call of Duty? <laughs> Except FS? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Oh, really? Was the beta not that great? What have I missed? I don't know much. Been harvesting. Talking. Chillaxing. Thought that I'd be able to use the straw. Can't. As you'll see in a minute. Actually, when I'm on the combine. I want Red Dead 2 so bad. Looks good. Don't have a console though, so. Yeah, 19 does look good so far. WWE, Forza, Red Dead, yep. Forza, <laughs> for me. That's the only AAA game that I could probably afford this year. Yeah, I agree. They were awesome battlefields back then. I get there's only so much you can do that before it gets way too samey. But, I don't know. That's where it's at. We may be able to fit all of this in one tank and not have to empty it over there once. Hey, love this far. Keep it coming. I'm blunt to Alex. What is the yellow loader on the thumbnail? That is by Creative Mesh, the same people who did the straw add on. It is available off of their Facebook page if you want to get and load it for free because it is a mod and all mods have to be free as part of their terms and conditions that Giants have put out there. World War 3 on Steam looks good. No, I heard of that one. Red Dead 2 is sitting waiting for me to get back home. So excited. Oh, nice one, dude. Now I want a new TV. If you've got a decent computer screen sim, why don't you just plug the console into that and plug your, for the time being, plug your computer into that screen? I have I don't use uh, extension. I haven't used it for a long time. Didn't get, didn't get on with it. I played Battlefield 4 for 20 days and 4 hours. 
and a school and hobbies in between, dang. No audio. Oh, uh, yes. Valid point. Does the screen not have an audio jack on it? I know some of them do. Call of Duty World War II was real good, yeah. Back in the day, like, the f shooting games when they were either Modern Warfare stuff or Second World War stuff were just second to none. They were great games. I really enjoyed, and it's still one of my all-time favorites, Call of Duty World at War. That was a damn good game. I think that's the one Bill could be on about there. Uh, there's Mass Fix in 2019. Yep. Kind of looks very, very similar to the new Holland, though, so I'm not too worried about it. Not too bothered. Have you tried the new American Spin uh, DLC for Spin Dice? Yes, and when I am on my break from Farming Simulator before the release of 19, I will probably be doing some episodes on that. Cod World at War, best Cod of all time. One of for sure. I think the earlier ones were still pretty sick. I may have to install that again. I actually installed. Uh, well, no. Modern, modern, Com modern Combat? No. Modern Warfare, the original. Put that back in on the computer to play that single player. Modern Warfare 2, favourite Cod was Max Prestige. Nice. Yeah, back then, the multiplayer on Call of Duty was so good. Nowadays, it's just... Uh, I don't think it's the same. What was the DLC like for American Truxen? Uh, what DLC for American Truxen? You want about Oregon? American Truxen did... I don't know if anyone else had it today. Updated big time. Like a... Almost 200 meg update. I know. I don't know why so many people are freaking out about the Massey Telly. It's like the new Holland one that we had in-game. Granted, that was a mod, but it was in-game. Very Oregon-esque. <laughs> Would you play Rainbow Six Siege? Nah, I'm not a big fan of the Rainbow stuff games. Really not. Oh, yeah, the Oregon DLC is pretty damn nice. Sim said it as best as I could. A very Oregon esque. I uh, thought they had collisions, I guess not. Wanna know something crazy? Just over 3,000 hours played. Oh, you and your damn left for dead, too. He made me get that ages ago. It's a good game, but it's the same thing over and over again. I, I, I don't know how you play it so much, Bill. Beyond me. Absolutely beyond me. Simulator's now rejoicing. There's a lot of people interested in 19 now since... Really? Dang. Instagram's a platform that I have an account on there. Uh, duh, 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 duh. Do I have it in here? No, I don't. I need to get a button for that. But I have an Instagram account, official landing kit, I think it is, but, yeah. Good game to troll. All the players on fl uh, fire and all that stuff. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and get them yelling at you down the mic, no doubt. Mr. I get banned from cool not Call of Duty, uh, GTA. Play BF, V, open beta, and it was epic. Interesting. Yeah, I never played it. But there again, I just had someone in here say that they didn't like it. Then they actually cancelled their pre-order.
Yeah, one thing you guys don't know probably about Bill, he is a big ass troller. He really is at times. Good grief. Who got banned from GTA? <clears throat> Bill's T Max. Didn't you, buddy oh, buddy oh, pal? Hope it's going good your way today. No, so far, so good. Apparently Call of Duty Beta was better than the released game. Oh, well, really? Good grief. All right, we have a decision. Now, for any of you that are in here, and I know I have quite a few people in here, probably a lot of you from SimStream. I usually, and I want to save the harvesting for the street, or for the videos. I could go up to field one, get some straw from the canola, hopefully, fingers crossed, or attempt it in this stream so we can mess around with the pellets. Do you guys want to see me do that? Or shall we do something else of God knows what? But I'll let you do, I'll let you guys decide that because if we harvest that field, you guys won't see me do that in a video. Actually, it was stinky. I think he had hacks in. I thought you got it. I thought you got nuked as well. Or did it nuke the IP, and which nuked you? Canola straw. Yeah, I got canola straw. Modern. So to get up, though, all I'll do is I'll pretty much... Wow. Uh, will I t trailer this up? Just harvest on here. <laughs> I'm scared. I'll let the masses decide. That being said, I'm pretty sure with uh, creative tools, we can probably make a field suddenly have crop in it. A GT5 online. Keep all my money I've made. Oh, okay. We got field 19 to harvest, that's a big old field. I'm doing pretty good, what about yourself? That's okay, Ethan. You've joined the best stream, the stream that hasn't gone completely and utterly foobar on you. Unlike Sims, Sims stream, oh, I feel sorry for him. One thing after another with him today. Is this map coming out? Do you know, uh... For you know what? I have no idea. It's in Giants for testing at this point. I think Giants have pretty much probably stopped testing. For the most point, I doubt it will come out in time. I, I really doubt it will come out in time. I want to make it clear. I'm not saying it won't come out. I'm just saying I doubt it will. <laughs> really? Only made in China. Turns out it was the header element. Yeah, if you have it on zero time as well, Sim, you got to be careful with that. Crop I noticed on my Oakfield save all of a sudden was fully grown and ready to go. If you've got seasons enabled though, which I don't know if you did on that map, it will wither everything, or if you forget to switch wither enough, it will probably nuke it very, very quickly. So that's probably why your crop was withered the first time around. Be out at 19 anyway. Yeah, exactly. Eventually. What's the best wheel for FS? Honestly. That's down to you. If you are literally just only going to play Farming Simulator, not Euro Truck, not American Truck, no racing games, then get the Farm Sim wheel. It's probably the best for you. As much as the build quality of that thing sucks, and it is overpriced for what it is, 
is probably the best for that application. If you are going to play all those other games that I just said about, get yourself a Logitech steering wheel of some sort. You can usually get them on sale really cheap. It also withered because I skipped a winter. Oh, they, there you go. Oh, yeah, you haven't got the little snow thing enabled anymore, do you? I bet. So you can dump snow down whenever. So this is our field with canola in. It's nothing crazy. Fan attack or nothing? Oh yeah. Stupid expensive. Good wheels though, no doubt, but damn expensive. Lama G27, perfect for all driving games. G27s are great and all. Good luck finding one. And have you seen the prices they're going for now? Good grief. Yeah, if you're in the UK, you can pick up from Curry's PC World a G920 or G29 for £150 with the shifter if you get it at the right time. I bought mine full price. Uh, I think I ended up paying like £344 for mine back when I got my wheel. And of course, that's still in the UK. And not that more than probably three months later, it was on sale for 150 Sucked. They went on sale very quick. He says, well, I was owning a Logitech. I need to find one in good condition, but the G20... The 7 is hard to find anywhere. Exactly, and even then, I don't know about you guys, I wouldn't want to have a steering wheel, especially with the type of material they're made out of, that other people have had their grubby, grubby hands all over. Eh, I'm not a clean freak by any shape or form. But something about that just... No, rather not. Where in the world? PC world, good lord. Sell out! Sell out! Let's wait for Black Friday deals to get away with. Yeah. And PC world and curries, they, those two seem to have them on sale quite frequently. They really do. I think Bill even got one ages ago. Goes to Max though. Which is probably kind of comical because I bet half of you guys that are in here probably don't know him. Nah, never will I own a second hand controller or keyboard or any form like that. Yeah, exactly. It's just. Eh. I don't know. Something about it personally. Like I said. The steering wheels are usually sort of some sort of fake lever which will absorb, hmm, grossness. Different story if it's just straight plastic, but even then you've got someone else's gunk. Yeah, no. Not to use frequently, at least. To cannibalize, to get stuff out of, to fix something? Sure. Don't know how long it will last, neither. Yeah, comp computer stuff, you don't know what it's been through. Going for a ways without washing their hands and touching their wheel. Way! Hey. I couldn't find one for under 300 in Ireland, so. My opinion, uh, curious costs. Yeah. I think Amazon may have them on sale once in a while for 152. And I'm obviously on about British pounds. If it wasn't so damn bulky, I'd love to get that, the wheel sent over here. So I'd probably use it quite a bit, to tell you the truth. Nice transit. Yeah, this is off of FSUK. Awesome little thing.
You've started to sort your folders for 19. How can you sort your folders for 19 when you won't have anything yet for it? And the game kind of does it all for you. Oh, it is way cheaper at times. Yeah. I'll always get a genuine Xbox controller though. I've had the second, sort of the cheap Chinese ones like you were just on about, and yeah, not had much luck with them back in the day. That was called back in the day. What mods am I going to miss in 19? All the scripts. I couldn't give a crap about vehicles and stuff like that. I know quite a few of them are coming back. Burst the scripts. Course play, because right away none of these are going to be coming out. Course play, drive control, GPS, the core scripts that I use day in, day out. Glance, stuff like that. This is scripts that I always miss. I'm oh, just deleting a uh, lot of. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll go through it at some point. And uninstall all of 17, get rid of a few of the mods. Some of the mods I want to keep around because I really do want to have a crack at converting stuff. But whether that'll happen or not, who knows. Well, the last cheap controller I bought was an analog stick. So I should register it as a D-pad never again, really. Dang. Is a hard convert mods over? Who knows? Who knows what you have to do? This time around, you're going to have to completely redo all the textures, which I don't know how that will be. And at the same time, do I really want to do that? Because you know what the community is like? Link, link, link. Private mod, link. And... I'm not about using uh, the damn gates, private mods, like that. Because it, it just it causes too much aggro at times. It really does. For a cup of tea, it might be back if you're still on. Depends how long it takes you to have a cup of tea. Catch you in a bit, though. I've been going for a while. Maybe because I know I can tonight. No, I'll just tap to it, it's not going to look decent, but oh well. Still open my PC this weekend? <laughs> yeah. I, I would love to do the same thing, to be honest with you, Sim, I need to. But as it happens, I may not be here at the back end of the week, so... I don't know. Still up in the air. Just wants to get away for a little while, so we may end up going away. I don't know. Yes, canola straw! It's working. Probably going to be patchy as well. Get up, but it's working. Happy days. Bought a Yeti Pro Studio mic. Uh, I still can't be bothered to set it up. Oh, <laughs> really? What do you get the Pro one for? I just got the regular one. Hey, Tyler, what's up? Hope they got the old case in 19. Yeah, hopefully. Hopefully. At least JD mod should be the same green in 19. Hopefully. Oh my god. That's crazy how much modders get the colour off. It's so bad. Like, it gets to the point like, okay, what's the correct colour of what it isn't?
because it sounds cool and professional. <laughs> yeah, that would be a nice track to have in the game. I'm surprised it's not, to tell you the truth. That's one of their John Deere's massive flagships. Surprised they would put in the AR instead of the RX and have the 7R in replacement of the 8. Probably because how small it is, Andy. And maybe it's not a track that you particularly see a lot of in the smaller applications in the UK that you'd see. If you watch a lot of UK streamers and stuff like that. I know what you mean, though. It's a track that you can basically turn multicolor if you wanted to. Uh, there is a still a coming soon on the page for John Deere, so there is something else coming. I've got a strong feeling it could be an old John Deere, but what that old John Deere could be, who knows? Is it a really old John Deere? Is it like a a 7010 series, or is it a 75 series? Who knows? Or 30 series, sorry, or a 10 series. See a lot of modders using the M for a base for older premiums. Uh, or the R. Oh, possibly, Sam. But it took a long time for us to ever get the RX in the game in the first place. Uh, the Gator is a pre order bonus for the Collector's Edition. Oh, no, I think it's actually the Collector's Edition straight up. Fifty five series or fifty five series would be nice. The old aero style cabs. Or no, the sound guard cabs? That's what they called them. Could be a seventy five thirty. Yeah, exactly. A lot of people are saying it could be the seventy five thirty because of the model in the collector's edition. I'm secretly really hoping for that. You guys know that's what one of my favourite John Deers. But we're just saying so uh, there's coming soon for Crone. Uh da, 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 da. The coming soon for Crone is probably the new Crone. Uh, forage harvester that we saw in one of the fact sheet pictures of forage being thrown into a trailer and if you look at that it is a 1180 which is their new flag sheep forage harvester with the big leap air v12 i think it is or is it a v10 engine one of the two big diesel engine It will, it will, CD. Honestly, they'd kill modern. They'd kill modern there and then if they didn't. And if they kill modern, more as well start looking for new jobs. I'll be very blunt at the end of the day. Because if it wasn't for the modders, the game would really not be going in the same place and same area as it is now. They can't expect modders to spend thousands upon thousands of pounds or dollars, or euros, on a hobby that is Maya. It's just, yeah, no. They'd be stupid. They would be absolutely stupid if they did that. No, it was all you, Sim. Not that you know of EJ. Giants don't push everything out on that website. There's possibly going to be more stuff. I'd imagine there will be, they're just not the same. At this point, they're not going to throw everything out there. Yeah, we are not going to get a lot of bales out of this look. Hey, Maddie, what's up? Uh, 
could be a combo. I really think it's going to be an older tractor. A company that's so proud of their heritage like John Deere. I'd be very, very surprised if it's not. They did say there's going to be a big surprise. What's that going to be? Who knows? Just because um, media with giants, whatever they want to call it, YouTuber, doesn't mean I am privy, same as Sim, doesn't mean either of us are privy to stuff that you guys know about. We know exactly the same as you. The only time we know stuff is usually the day before fact sheets come out, we have the fact sheets in our inbox. I'll be honest, there's nothing to hide there. At least it's usually 24 hours notice before you guys know stuff. I get what you mean, Andy, for sure. Cyberbug, but yeah, Kubota yesterday, got to get on that topic. A lot of you saw the images, I posted them on my Discord. That was very, very, very poor planning by their Polish publisher for Farming Simulator 19 at a Polish gaming convention, if you like. So they didn't really think that one through. And no doubt they got an interesting email from Giants going, uh, you have caused mass confusion. Well done. Do you think there'll be a telehand JCB telehandler? Hopefully. Hopefully. Well, one of the largest American style JDs. I don't think they've been in contact with John Deere North America. I think it has been John Deere Europe, so it's probably not going to be a North American style machine. I'll be completely honest with you there. I was surprised to see Fiat. I was so shocked. I'll be honest, shocked to see Fiat for 19. That was a nice surprise, though. Mr. Simulator, if you are still here, you are a very, very, very big dink. Uh, yeah, there's, uh, no, yeah, but there is no coming soon for JD. Combines confirmed by Lars. True, that is very true. Oh crap, didn't load the head now. It's probably going to be a tractor, like I said. Probably going to be a tractor. Did we see when seen through fruit drummer lover again English please this is the third time I've been hoping to see a JCB telehandler yeah um, a comment showing up the comments aren't showing up yeah yeah they are you're putting me off R&D <laughs> you're putting me off my stream there yeah, how was that for you you're on, honestly on about, obviously on about consoles, yep, boy. Which I, I have them in the blacklist, I need to take them out. And that was when people were constantly on about, is it coming a console for mods? I believe the foragers and stuff are all under the combine root, well, uh, tab for whatever reason. Are there... Uh, for sure they said there's another surprise coming a little while back. Easy when your keyboard lights up. Yeah, lights on the keyboard are absolutely amazing. Another hunch that I think a few of us have got is possibly we'll see a John Deere DLC too. Later down the line. Just like we did with Coom. Coom were base in game. They had a few stuff and then we had a crap ton of their stuff as DLC, paid DLC. That's a Limpkin in 19. I believe we had Limpkin stuff in the game already though, no?
Uh, no, the 148 will not be coming up on Giant's website because Giant's pretty much stopped testing. You'll have to get it from FSUK, which you shouldn't have any issues about getting FSUK. Do you think uh, they'll do Kubota tractors? I'm surprised we've not seen Kubota in the game already. Kind of surprised on that one. It's a company that I've always wanted to see in the game. They are up and coming, for sure. Getting better technology, getting better machines. No matter what people say, they are moving at a very, very rapid rate. Not as drastically in the ag market yet. They're getting there. They just I don't think they don't have quite have the heavy enough tractors for them yet. Uh try a hundredth anniversary. How do you get Canola Straw? By downloading Canola Straw mod. This is something that the game should do default to be quite honest. Do you, what do you think of the dog in Farm Simulator 19? A waste of time. Nah, that's my honest opinion though. Do you think FS19 will come out on Fudge or Freezer? Sure. Yeah, the blue power I think is console only, isn't it? Which is a shame to see it on consoles again, just consoles. I would love to see the blue power in the base game. I know a lot of people have got a lot of love for that tractor. Surprised no John Deere Cedars. Did John, John Deere do a lot of European Cedars though? I don't think they do. Kubota make vending machines. <laughs> yeah, your typing's atrocious. So for me, sort of European cedar stuff, you hear more Vardastad, Limkin, Amazon, companies like that. Thanks for the support. <laughs> well, you see, there's a thing called a light. Switch it on. Or make it, if you're on your computer, bright background, turn your screen down if it's just on a laptop. And I'm almost out of coffee. Yeah, Blue Power was exclusive to PlayStation, if memory says correctly. Which I'll be completely honest. I know every device out there gets exclusives, whether it's PC, consoles, whatever. I wish it wasn't like that. I wish every platform didn't have the exclusivity of one machine or anything. Just make it so everybody can get it and enjoy it. Because, let's face it, on Xbox there's probably fans of Blue Power. On PC, there's definitely fans of Blue Power. On console, on PlayStation, there's obviously fans of Blue Power. Make it so everyone can enjoy it. I don't get it. I really don't. The exclusives, as far as I I think, and we should be sort of pre-order bonuses, stuff like that. And even then, you, I know, we'll be seeing them very shortly after the game's released anyway. Bum bum <laughs> nice one, Sim. Nice one. Uh, you know, you get an old when you find that joke's funny. <laughs> Tell you what, the dad jokes thing. That's becoming more and more popular now. Like, recently, within the last month or so. You start hearing that a lot more. 
Now you see my light bulb went out. Oh, LOL. Well. Then go change it. It doesn't take five seconds to change a light bulb. Or there's a crazy thing called a torch, or if you're American, a flashlight. And they light up your day. How about that one? Or in your case, your keys. Dern Gamer and Peter, what's up? <laughs> My neighbor down the road is selling a budget, it's going cheap, cheap, but dum bum ch. I don't know how, I generally don't. Oh my. It is actually legit very, very, very easy. As long as, you've, as long as it's not hot and you've got your light switch switched off, you either, if it's a, the screw fixture, you just keep screwing it until it comes out, or if it's the bayonet fitting where it, you turn it maybe like, what was it, quarter of a turn, and it unclips, then you push it in and push it up, and turn it again and it's in. Literally takes seconds. How many drummer, drummer lovers does it take to ch change a light bulb? If the dude generally doesn't know how, which I'm not going to take the f sort of pee out of him, I don't know how old he is, then uh, probably quite a few. Silver metal in the socket will light up your day. Yeah. And that'll be the end of your day. And your life. Use the forklift. The massy yoke. Well, I could use it if I had any pallets to move. But if I don't have any pallets to move right now, why would I use the forklift? Oh, it has been good, Patrick. What about yours? Just been chilling today, really. I haven't got a lot done, I'll be completely honest with you. Got tomorrow's video done, but a kind of a chill day. Need to st sort out sticky keys. Oh, I can't help you there, my friend. Sim probably can, though. Hey, Sim. Weeds and nineteen. Oh yeah. The massive forklift in the farm now, model farmer. Peter J's one that he released on FSUK yesterday. Farmer Dan, what's going on? Oh, that's a horrible song. Dang. You'll see in a minute. I'm using keyboard. The keyboard, wow. I'm using control, as always. Nice to see a forklift in 19. Yeah, it's nice to see a forklift in 19 for sure. Kind of makes me think we're going to be using, or there's going to be stuff in game to do with pallets. A lot more of them. Still, we've needed for a while though. I don't think the collector's edition is offered in the US. I don't know. It's appearing not. Uh, if you go on Giants Discord, ask in there, and one of the devs will probably be able to set you straight. I'm surprised it's not. Uh, to be quite honest, from what I've been hearing. Because it sounds like a troll, yeah. Bumper buttons are incredibly loud on this thing. I want to open up the controller and see if I can fix the 
bumper buttons so they're not so loud, the clickiness on there, because it, it drives me up the wall hearing it in the videos. It really does, but there's nothing much I can do about it. It's either you hear clicking of the mouse or clicking of the bumper buttons. Uh, Drummer Lover, all I did was plug it in, literally. Make sure in your microphone volume, you do not have it set to 100%. It's obviously a lot higher quality microphone than you're possibly used to, so you don't need it at 100%. And download Audacity and set up your game properly. Don't have it cranked because your mic will sound like crap. And that's forklift. The egg boxes, I think they are literally cardboard boxes, so I don't think we'll need a forklift for them. Not unless you can put them on a pallet, which I don't think you can. PS4 don't click. Neither do the newer Xbox controllers. Like, my old Xbox controller was dead quiet compared to this one. Uh, both of them Xbox One controllers, but this one, I don't know why, but it's very clicky. Uh, Jess's cousin has an Xbox One, and his controller is deadly quiet compared to mine. It is crazy. So I really don't know what's up with it. It's just something it's always been like. Alright, so I'm not going to worry about putting these away. I just want to do the outside rounds, and then we'll probably end the stream on that note. And depending on what we are doing tomorrow is whether we'll do farmsome or not. I think we'll probably be on farmsome to tell you guys the truth. And as for Thursday, Friday and Saturday, I have no damn idea if I will be streaming. Actually, I kind of want... Uh... No, I know a lot of you probably want to see. No, wrong tractor. This. Trippy hair was made here in Ireland. Yep, that's why I'm using it. Catch you later, buddy. Oh, it's your many streams about when I have been streaming for one hour, twenty five minutes. So I've been getting, the streams been going for quite a while. How do you think FS19 looks? Very, very nice, for sure. Hey Alex, what's up? You won't truly know how good FS looks until you see it in front of your, well, on your own screen, basically, in front of you. Pictures can only do it so much. Hope there'll be more Baylors and just a New Holland in 19. Well, we've got the Coombe ones. Uh, they're in the game, so you've got them. Uh, other than that, who knows? You just got back from football, so that's uh, quite a lot of the time. 
So much luck. Oh, very nice. Usually I private the stream right after it, so I'm surprised you can do that. Again, the cotton harvesters are under combines. They're under the harvester section, so there's a no on that one. Lister Town has said on Discord that there are no more harvesters. John Deere harvesters coming to 19. Whether that was just combine harvesters or harvesters blanket, so forage harvesters or cotton. I'm kind of surprised we haven't seen a John Deere cotton harvester. Very surprised, actually. Maybe that's going out on live push out. Oh. I would say nice, but it's not really nice. I will say I hope hopefully he returns safely. How's that? Going way, way back before I was ever in the picture, my dad used to be lifeboat crew at Wales Next to Sea on a boat called the Ernest Tom. So know what about that stuff from the stories he has told me back in the day. Yeah, it's definitely light on the straw, the canola. I'm not surprised really, it is a mod making it do it, so. No, the only type of trader I've got on this map, I think, are those ones that I'm using. See these ones, at least. So, uh, this is where I c shall call it quits for the stream. I'll finish this up in a video. So, that video will be released for Thursday? Yeah, Thursday. Because I'm now down, for anyone wondering, I am now down to just Oakfield Farm and Shamrock Valley to finish up FS17. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed. We will be back tomorrow, more than likely farm simming, more than likely on this map. So until next time, hope you guys enjoyed. Catch you guys later. See ya.